Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is gonna be a what I wore in a week. So I'm gonna be showing you my outfits every day. I thought this was a good way for you guys to get some ideas of how to style some of the pieces you already have in your wardrobe or maybe find some new pieces as well. I'm gonna be linking everything in the description box that I'm wearing as well as kind of like alternative suggestions for similar things. There are some mega sales coming soon. So you can save this video to your watch later playlist and come back to it if you're doing some shopping. So let me flash back to yesterday, Monday, where I showed you guys my first outfit of the week. Okay, so today is Monday, which means I need to be comfortable because the first half of the day, every Monday, we record our podcast. So that means me sitting on my chair over there on my desk and I just need to be comfortable. And then because it takes kind of half the day, I tend to not do much creative stuff on a Monday, which means I don't really need to look good. So it's very much a casual day. My hair is greasy. I need to wash it tonight and I'm wearing loungewear. This loungewear set is from Me and M and I would say that I think the Me and M loungewear is like slightly smarter than other loungewear. Maybe not this top actually, this top's quite relaxed. So this set um, go together. I really like the top because it's different. It's kind of got three quarter length sleeves like bat wing and it's kind of cropped as well but it doesn't matter because the bottoms are so high waisted you don't actually see any stomach. And these, these are just my really, really comfy lounging around the house loungewear although the bottoms I would say are like a bit smarter than others because of the material they're made from they just feel less like tracksuit bottoms and more like trousers so that's what I love about me and M they're kind of like smarter loungewear so this set go together these are the joggers like I kind of just showed you they've got like a panel down the side this really nice blue color and I'm wearing my hush slippers with this. I am obsessed with these. I actually don't think I realized how much I was gonna love them. Someone told me they have the white company ones and they find them too slippery. They kind of almost fell down the stairs because I think they said that this bit you stand on is kind of satiny. These are fully faux fur all over and they are, I find them definitely grippy enough. I like that I can just slip them on because my other slippers I've had in the past have been more like shoes. These I can literally just go like whoop and then I'm wearing my slippers. So they are perfect. This is what I'm wearing for a Monday. I will link below other um, me and M loungewear that I love because they have a few different types. Some of the tops are a little bit smarter, like I've got a granddad collar one with buttons, which I love, and like a waffle knit one. You obviously don't have to buy them together, so you can just buy the tops, you can just buy the joggers. Their joggers, I would say, are like the best ever. Like I said, you can wear them for smarter occasions as well when you're out, like with trainers or whatever. This is Monday. Okay, back to today. It is Tuesday and I'm gonna be working again today. Rich has the week off work this week so I can get a lot more work in, which is great. So I am properly dressed today. I'm hoping to take some photos, um, film some videos, and I'll probably be going out at some point as well. So let me show you today's outfit. First of all, I'm wearing the round curb chain necklace from Missima, which I love. This jumper is from Le Mot, who I absolutely love as a brand. I've had some of their t-shirts and jumpers before. They've just brought out a new range that's very like minimal in style. I absolutely love, I love the fit of this jumper, even down to like the wrists. I can't really explain it, but it fits very well. It's really nice and like soft on the lining. Absolutely love this. I'm actually not wearing anything underneath because it's so comfortable and soft. So I've got this white jumper, which I think looks quite like chic, but casual at the same time. And then I'm wearing it with these jeans, which are from Mango. So they're the ones, they've got buttons here. They're kind of high-waisted but straight and cropped, which is usually the style that I go for, unless I'm wearing like a massively oversized jumper, and then I'll go for a skinny jean. But this is the style I feel most comfortable in at the moment. I'm still kind of figuring out, getting my confidence back when wearing jeans, but I do think these are really nice. And then on my feet, I'm wearing the Veja white Velcro trainers. Let me do a little close up to show you guys. I just think if you want something, if you want a trainer that's kind of, smarter and chicer. I just think the plain white Velcro trainers are so nice, also really handy. If you are in a rush and you just wanna like quickly whack on your shoes or like, you know, you're holding a child in one hand or something. So this is today's outfit. 
I am loving it. I'm comfortable, I feel confident, and this feels like a very me outfit. So as I said, I'll link everything down below and some alternatives as well. Oh, I forgot to show you uh, the coat that I'll be wearing when I go out, one sec. This coat is from Zara and I absolutely love it. From like the teddy bear kind of fluffy detailing to the fact that it's got a massive hood. Let me put it up and show you, <gasps> amazing. Also, it's a zip, like this literally ticks all the boxes. It has massive pockets and I just love it slightly longer at the back. I love the way it fits. I love everything about this coat. Teddy bear coats are definitely back in this year and I am here for it. I just think they're so cozy and comfy in the winter. It's really good for like layering. You could wear like a long sleeve top, a jumper, like a hoodie. You could literally just layer as much as you want and it wouldn't look ridiculous because it's kind of oversized anyway. I know I was brave going for this color. I don't wear this on days where it's just me and gray because I know she'll want me to pick her up and she'll be muddy and I wouldn't wear this on a muddy walk. But when I can, I absolutely love wearing this. So yeah, this is from Zara and I'll link a few other teddy bear coats that I like as well. Good morning guys. Today is Wednesday and I'm gonna show you what I'm wearing today. I'm wearing jeans again. This time it's the Topshop Jamie jeans so these are a skinny jean and I don't buy a lot from Topshop these days but these are the best skinny jeans that I've tried I haven't actually tried any recently to be fair these are quite a few years old but there's just no reason for me to buy any new ones they've got a really good like stretch to them so they're comfortable they don't cut in they're really high-waisted so they kind of feel like they're sucking you in a little bit and I just find them so so comfortable I tend to only wear skinny jeans these days when I'm wearing a big oversized top. So I'm wearing blue skinny jeans today and then this is a jumper from Arquette and I love this. I wanna get it in every color. I don't think it comes in more than two colors annoyingly, but it's basically just a big oversized long black jumper and I love the length. I love that it covers the bum. I've worn this with black joggers and I think it looks quite cool as well. So. I just love that it's very simple and very comfortable. And I'm just wearing a simple um, snake chain necklace with that just to make it a little bit smarter. Shoes wise, I'm wearing these boots. These are from and other stories either last year or the year before and I wear them like almost every day. I feel like they are appropriate for so many different situations. They can be smartened up. They're perfect for like a winter walk. They've got like a thick rubbery base and they're so comfortable around the ankle. They're not tight, they're warm. I absolutely love these boots. I don't know if they still do these exact ones, but I'll link some like similar types. And I like that it's like oversized, tight skinny, chunky boot. This is a very frequently worn outfit of mine. I'm gonna head out for a little walk today and this is probably the coat that I would grab because it's kind of slightly drizzly and cold. So this is just a massive like oversized padded coat. I think everyone kind of needs one of these in their wardrobe. There are shorter ones. This one's slightly longer. It comes just to below the bum. I would absolutely love one from North Face. I got one for Richard's birthday last year he's got a really good one although this is really good quality as well this is from Zara I love how absolutely massive the hood is big pockets just yeah really good kind of winter coat so that's Wednesday's outfit okay it is Thursday and I'm checking in on what I'm wearing today first of all I need to tell you guys about these joggers I feel like I'm a jogger expert these days they're my favorite things to wear ever these are from Hush, they're called the Lindsay Joggers. I love them. Now it needs a disclaimer, there are no pockets, which I know is a big deal to some people, and I kind of wish they had pockets, some of their other ones do, but I absolutely love, oh sorry, they're a bit dirty, I love the fabric, I love how they feel, they're kind of oversized, and I just roll them up a couple of times. I really like this kind of duck egg color. I feel like they really don't look flattering on camera, but they are so, so comfortable. I'm wearing them with my Veja trainers. These are just the white ones with the black V. These are the ones I wear like every day. They're so dirty, I love them. And then on top, I'm wearing this long sleeve top. I need to get more long sleeve tops. I find them so handy, like when a jumper's too warm, but you, like a t-shirt's too t-shirty. <laughs> this is a waffle knit top. I absolutely love waffle knit and it's got a pocket. And this is actually from the men's section of Uniqlo. It comes in quite a few colors. I really like it. I wanna get it in black 
maybe white as well. I wear it a lot. I layer it under things. I kind of roll up the sleeves. I really love this. So I'm just wearing long sleeve top, the joggers, trainers. And then what I love doing at the moment is wearing like a very casual kind of jogger outfit and then putting on a slightly more kind of smarter tailored coat. This one is from And Other Stories last year. It's wool. It's got massive lapels. I actually, I'm never sure if I like how big they are. I wish they were a bit smaller. But I love this coat, I love how long it is. I think a really long coat looks really cool with joggers and trainers. Um, I really like the colour of it. Also, this cashmere beanie from And Other Stories. This one's grey, but they have it in so many colours and they've got an oatmeal one, which I think would work better with this outfit. To me, this is the perfect hat because it's soft and warm, stretchy, it doesn't like squeeze your head and give you a headache. And then it's got a little bit of like extra fabric here, but not too much. I find it really hard to get the perfect like winter hat and I love these cashmere beanies from And Other Stories and like I said they come in so many colours. So this is today's outfit. Morning guys, it is Friday today and I just got back from a morning walk with Grey. So I'm covered in mud, she's at that age where she doesn't really want to go in the buggy but she's not big enough to like walk an entire walk so she walks a bit and then she wants to be carried and then her muddy wellies go all over my clothes. But it's fine, I think it's gonna go in the wash. Um, so excuse the muddiness of my outfit, I forgot to show you this morning, so I thought I would show you now. I'm wearing just a really long coat, it's actually not that cold today, so I just put on this coat, I've had this for years, I love it, it's whistles, it's two-tone, this bit's kind of a bit, they're like slightly different fabrics, this is a bit kind of furry, it's just grey, dark grey, and then again, a hood, so handy, especially if you're pushing a buggy. Whistles do great coats. Actually, Whistles have 25% off their entire site at the moment, which is amazing. Um, I got a really nice jumper from there. Underneath the coat, I'm wearing this jumper from Arquette. I think it's a cashmere blend, but it's oversized. I love the kind of big, baggy jumper. I love camel as a colour. It's kind of neutral, but it's not like as boring as black and grey. Really like that. And then with that, I'm wearing, um, I'm a bit camel-y actually. Maybe it's a bit too much camel. I've worn this outfit before. These tracksuits are old, but they're from me and M. I love how simple they are. Just black with like two camel stripes down the side. Very comfortable. Absolutely covered in mud. Thank you, Grey. And then the shoes I'm wearing, again, are from Veja. I love everything they do, but these are so comfortable. They're like suede, camel with a black V. They're kind of like boots, but kind of like trainers. Really, really comfortable. I don't think they've got any like this at the moment, but if they do these again, I would say snap them up because I really love them. They look great with jeans as well. So that is today's outfit. And that's the last one I'm not going to do Saturday and Sunday, mainly because this video needs to go up on Sunday, so I need to go edit it now. <laughs> but I hope you guys like seeing what I've been wearing all week, and like I said, I'll link everything that is still available. A lot of my clothes are old, but if they are not available, I'll also link some alternatives. And I've actually got another video coming on Wednesday, which is a nice little like extra treat for the week, so I'll see you guys in that video too. Bye!